What is going on everybody? Welcome back to Hella Good Recipes. I'm your host Dean. Today we're going to be making the Billionaire Margarita. I recently came across this recipe online at food.com and I didn't follow it exactly but I did my own little version. Still great margarita to make if you guys can afford it because as you can see here it is 130 bucks a bottle on sale at Costco right now. I had to get me one. This is one of the smoothest tequilas I've ever had. It is my new favorite. You guys are gonna love it too, and it's even better in a margarita. So let's go ahead and get started. You guys are gonna need fresh limes, nothing out of a bottle. You guys don't want that crap, you're gonna ruin your kill with it. Margarita salt, if you want that for your rim. A little bit of simple syrup. Some freshly squeezed lime juice. I just put mine in a bottle here just to make it more convenient. And you're gonna need some orange liqueur of some sort. I have some Grand Marnier here. And of course your bottle of 1942. So go ahead and start with cutting a slit in a lime if you're gonna go ahead and add salt to your rim. You wanna do this ahead of time just so that your um, mixture later isn't just sitting there getting watered down while you do this extra step. Go ahead and set that aside. Here I'm also gonna get my garnish ready too. This is a channel cutter I'm using just to cut a small channel out of the lime. It brings out a lot of the zest and fresh oils, of course, out of the lime and just brightens up the drink overall. All right, so in a tumbler, you're gonna to wanna to get some ice and go ahead and pour 25 mils of your orange liqueur. Go ahead and pour 25 mils of that freshly squeezed lime juice. Carefully crack open that bottle of 1942 and we're gonna go ahead and pour 50 mils here. This recipe is very simple. It's two to one, one ratio. You can do this pretty much with any tequila, but it makes a nice strong stiff drink with this. Now go ahead and add your simple syrup to your taste. I hear I added half a tablespoon. I don't like too much. I still like the very strong drink. Go ahead and give that a shake. Get your glass from earlier. Go ahead and throw in one large ice cube. You guys don't want a bunch of crushed ice or nothing. You're gonna water down your tequila too fast. That's not what this drink is about. It is about the 1942 and you wanna try every little bit of it. Go ahead and strain and pour. And guys, don't forget to try the tequila on its own. Take a straight shot. You're not gonna regret it. It's one of the best, smoothest tasting tequilas ever. All right, so here I'm just getting that channel we cut out earlier from our lime. Go ahead and throw that in there. It looks great. It adds so much bold lime flavor to the margarita, guys. You seriously have to try it sometime. And you are all done. You have made one of the best margaritas you have ever had. Trust me, you want to go ahead and try this. So if you guys enjoyed that video, don't forget to leave a thumbs up, smash that subscribe button, and I'll see you guys in the next one.